here at Caesar's Palace. I love this hotel. I've stayed here several times. Mr. Martini and I haven't been here in a long time. It's just absolutely beautiful. We haven't been to Vegas probably in about 15 years. So, but we usually stay at the Mirage and we haven't stayed at Caesars in quite some time. So I'm really excited and I'm exhausted. It's like seven in the morning. Um, we got up at 2.30 to catch a six o'clock plane and I'm beat. But of course we're having mimosas at the bar. I remember, I remember when she was playing here in Vegas. I want to say it was the Hilton, or, or maybe it was Caesars, and they had this motorcycle in the lobby with like a mannequin of her. And my dad sat there and stared at that thing for the longest time. He was so in love with Anne Margaret. But this is history. History happens here and there's just has pictures of a bunch of stars that have even performed here or just stayed here. You know, NSYNC, Madonna, the Hudson Brothers, Miley, Sammy Davis, all sorts of people. Yep, there's Robbie Knievel. His dad um, tried to jump the fountains out front. We'll show you where. And didn't he try also? I think he did it. He was he had a lot better of equipment and was a lot more skilled than right, his father. Right, right. Yeah, Robbie Knievel. Okay, so is this where Evil Knievel jumped? Didn't they put the ramps like right I'm here? I'm not sure. We'd have to Google it. It seems like they did. Like it was in front here and they did this whole I area. It was a different area. No, I, I think it was the front. Cause I remember, I remember watching it on TV and going, I've been there with my parents. Not a very big jump. Well, if he had started, well, this probably wasn't here. This is probably all new. Man. I don't think this is the, the same fountain. Yeah, I don't think it is either. I think it's another fountain somewhere we have to find. So if I remember correctly, when I was a kid, there were fountains here. And I think that he went over there. And when Robbie did it, he went down into a, he, I think he went down in here. Yeah, but how the hell do you jump from over there? I don't he, think it's the fountain. Plus, it's too small. He jumped shit over 100 feet. I think it was yeah. 100 feet. The fountain's like 30 feet. Yeah, I think it's a different fountain. I bet you if we uh, we'll ask, ask somebody that, that one of these guys over here, they'll tell us. I like the Hellcat Durango, though. <laughs> I think this is the fountain, too. Because I remember them being in the front like this hey look they have a ramp for them <laughs> yeah, that's for the wheelbarrow <laughs> so yeah we doing it this is the fountains that's what was so in is they are redoing them so what direction did he go in did he go like probably went right uh, in there i don't know maybe jump what you think he went into the flamingo i don't know wouldn't be a problem they own it too <laughs> <laughs> I think this is the fountain though. Yeah, I think it is too. And I think where he went down underground is over here. What happened? I said this is where Evil Can Evil jump. And when he went off his ramp right here, he actually took the head off that sixteenth century <laughs> statue. Okay. All right. Very nice. Let's look at the bathroom. We got, well, wait. So we've got like all this closet space. A ton of closet space. Is there like safe? Perfect. It's just the, so that's not closet. Let's look at this bathroom. Mm, perfect. Yeah. Bathtub and a shower. Perfect. Yay. When it comes to pool areas, one of my favorite places to go is Caesar's Palace. Where else can you play in a, an Italian fountain? Let's go take a look. 
So this is one of the nicest pools, I think, mm -hmm. in Vegas. So this is not just a water, uh, not a waterfall, but a, f a fountain, but it's also a pool. And if you look right there, that's a bar. There's a bunch of people sitting around it, and you can gamble there, too. Um, I don't know if those are private up there. I know there's a private adult area uh, where you have to be 21 to go in. It's probably this place right here. Um, the one thing I don't like about pools in Vegas is they're usually closed down by 5 o'clock, which I find really frustrating because a lot of times when I'm here, I'm here on a conference like I am now, and I go till 5 o'clock. So I never get to enjoy these beautiful pools, and it's kind of frustrating. room is somewhere up on this side. Oh, this is way awesome. <laughs> yeah, he said all, all, the only reason it's an adult pool is they serve alcohol and they don't want kids and they can check your ID when you come up to the pool. Well, you know, a lot of times uh, we don't want kids. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> Very cool place. the lifeguard stations <laughs> when i was here with devore we had a place like this where we hung out one. all day they're expensive they're like a thousand something oh, that's bar too. yeah they... that guy spent so much money it was silly this is cool caesar's pool i've met cabana in different positions and <laughs> different places <laughs> They've been partying hardy. <laughs> So again, it's not Snackamus humongous. <laughs> no, Snackamus maximus. Snack Snackus. <laughs> How do you Maximus say that? Maximus. Yeah, that's the snack bar. That's funny. It's another pool. I think there's one there and I think there's one on the other side. Yeah, these cabanas, I looked at them just out of curiosity. They were pretty damn expensive. But if you go in with a bunch of people. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's what it looks like. Like a lot of people, young. Yeah, this is like a party of, of people that came here together. So they have a bar there too. And a swim up bar. And a swim up bar, yeah. This is the party pool <laughs> for sure. It's a little yellow, isn't it? <laughs> Just get married in the garden over there. Is that where the little chapel of love is? No, it's that outdoor garden over here she's going to. That was sarcasm to me. <laughs> when you come, I highly recommend that you ask for the palace tower because this is what you have a view of, or the pools down here.
You're planning your airplane flight here. Try to get here before check-in if you can, or take the extra money and spend an early check-in because this is for, this is what, three o'clock right now? And this is what happens.